chi-square goodness of fit test in Jamuvi using a second method. The chi-square test is performed when there is single categorial variable. This categorial variable can have at least two levels in it and it is called dichotomous variable such as male, females, life or dead or the categorial variable can have more than two levels in it. Uh, it is called multinomial or nomial variable and uh, it can have four levels such as profession, doctor, dentist, scientist and pharmacist. The chi-square also can be used for analysis of single ordinal data. The test can be used to determine whether there is a significant difference between observed count compared to expected count. Here in this Jamuvi data view variable, the first one is the categorial that have four levels in it, doctor, secretary, pharmacist and nurses and frequencies or the count for each one of these level. To perform chi-square goodness of fit test, click on frequencies, scroll down to in outcomes, uh, chi's goodness of fit test, and then in this new window, move the jobs into the variable and the frequency into the count and then tick on the expected counts and tick on the expected proportion. Um, as shown here in the right hand side table, the count, observed count for the doctor is 34 and for secretary is 54 and all the expected count has equal proportions or percentage or count. So the test will examine the hypothesis that there is an equal proportion for the expected value. The second table shows the value for the chi-square which is 14.7 and the degree of freedom which is equal to n minus 1 n is the level of the um, or the levels within a, a, a categorial variable, which is 4 minus 1 equal to 3, and the p-value is less than 0.05. So this test shows that there is a significant difference between observed count compared to expected count when the hypothesis state that there is equal proportion. Looking at the left section here, the expected value can be set at a certain proportion. So the hypothesis can be tested that there is an unequal proportion. And that to do that, let's set up that the doctor expected count or percentage is to be 10%, point 0.1. For the secretary, point 0.2 for the pharmacist point 0.3 which is 30% and for the nurses 40%. As shown here in the right hand side, the first table shows that the values or the count had been changed. So for the doctor, the expected count is 20 now and for secretary 40 and for pharmacist 60 and for nurses 80 and the chi square value is calculated to be 21.4 and the p value is less than 0.05 so this chi square goodness of fit test under the hypothesis of unequal proportion for the expected value shows that there is a significant differences between observed count and expected count. So this is the way 
to perform chi-square goodness of fit test in Jamuvi.